Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So this is my third video I'm filming today, but it'll be the first one I uploaded, which is really weird. Today's video, as you can probably tell by the title, is brands I want to try in 2019. I'm doing this video because I saw Angelica on YouTube doing it and I really loved it and I thought it would be a great opportunity for me to do that and then see if I actually do get to try them when the year ends. And I suppose it kind of sets a little goal for me to, to try other brands that I haven't before. Let's get into it. So the first one on my list is Sydney Grace Co. I've been following their Instagram for a while now. Also found them through my friend Cara and Angelica. I have no words. Their formulas for eyeshadows and their cream eyeshadows absolutely look incredible. Super pigmented and they look creamy and they look absolutely amazing. So I really, really want to try them and give them a go. I'll put some pictures up, I think, hopefully. They just are so stunning. And the owner as well, like she's seems like a really down-to-earth person and because I follow the Instagram as well I see the stories and live swatches and everything and it just looks so good if you want a particular color you can just buy that individually they're super affordable her cream eyeshadows are eight dollars and her regular eyeshadows are six also I think this is USD though so for my Aussie friends it will be a little bit more expensive but that's still super cheap so definitely want to give them a go especially for those eyeshadows and cream shadows I think they're like the top of my want to try list the next brand on my list is blush tribe now they're also I believe another like indie sort of company I've been following their Instagram for also a while now and same thing I found them through Angelica and Cara and their eyeshadow palette combination colors are really unique and I quite like that it's not just the same thing because I feel like companies these days like they're all in such competition with each other and they just keep making the same things part. I just wanna branch out and try some more unique color combinations. Their eyeshadows are extremely pigmented and they just brought out these really crazy neon pigments, which I think would be super interesting to try. Their eyeshadow palettes are still quite affordable, like $45 for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, no, five. For 15 shadows in a palette, $45. So really affordable. I, they look like regular pan sizes, if not a bit bigger. That's why they're on my list. The next brand on my list is something that probably everybody and their mama has tried. But I just seem to have missed this. And I'm late to the party, of course. I'm classic Sherilyn. It is Juvia's Place. I love their pigmentation like it is crazy 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 it is so insane i really want to try them i think they come out with some beautiful palettes even the palettes themselves the creative design of them is so beautiful and i would love to have that a part of my collection they're just really unique as well even their neutral palette looks amazing so they're super affordable as well and you can get them on beauty bay thank goodness i'm really wanting to try them this year also judging by those last three can you tell that i love eyeshadow this one's a little bit different i think the next brand i want to try is give me glow cosmetics now they are known for their crazy beautiful highlighters and i love them i do want to try them but what really drew me to their instagram was their liquid lipstick squ squatches no <sighs> cannot speak say that five times fast liquid lipstick swatches Li liquid lipstick swatches liquid lipstick squat can't do it just can't their liquid lipstick swatches are super beautiful i love their co the colors they come out with their packaging is absolutely beautiful they have some really nice rich orange brown neutral colors which are stunning and i love them and i really want to get them and try them and they have these cute little mini liquid lipstick bundles so you can try them and i really like that that's why i really want to try them also they have these really amazing videos on their instagram of them swatching like their highlighters with a brush and they are crazy glittery um like insane i don't know if it's their pigments or highlighters but 
they are beautiful so I want to try those I know I definitely want to try those I'm a sucker for anything with glitter in it the next brand is Davina Cosmetics they are another indie eyeshadow brand again I love eyeshadow can't help it I would just love any eyeshadows that are super pigmented and affordable and there's a crazy affordable yeah so their eyeshadows are even cheaper than sydney grace co's they're five dollars usd i believe again i would have to pay a little bit extra but that's okay because that's still really affordable i love single eyeshadows i love that i can just buy specific colors and i don't get overloaded with the same thing so i definitely want to try them give them a go they have some beautiful highlighter and um, shimmer shades in their collection as well so I'm definitely keen and down to try those next is Jazzy Glitter I don't know if you guys have heard of this company but they started off really small as she just took off like a freaking kite like amazing um, and since then her products have just been getting better and better Jazzy does amazing glitter compilations her Instagram is crazy she shows videos of her mixing the glitters and I find that so satisfying when she's like pouring like a pink and a green glitter together and just mixes it up and they're so beautiful. I just, I die. Super chunky, really unique glitter combinations and love it. They're super affordable. Again, she does bundles now, which I love. Um, so you can get like bundles and get like a little bit of a sneaky discount. So I definitely want to be trying those this year. I just really want to try a chunky glitter. I haven't really tried one before. So that would be really awesome. The next one everyone's already tried again and I haven't because I just haven't but I will I will because I really want to this one is the cover effects brand I really want to try the cover effects enhancer drops like they are stunningly beautiful and they were so popular they're probably not as popular now but I don't care I will want to try them still I'm sure that they will be bringing out other popular products in the future as well so we'll see what they come out with but yeah definitely want to give them a go this year they're on my list we'll see maybe it'll be time to replace my favorite Inglot highlighters the next brand I want to try is Jeffree Star Cosmetics he has been bringing out some really crazy unique stuff and I am loving it. His things are so pigmented. His ideas are so unique. His palette combinations are crazy beautiful. And I think that he's doing a really awesome job. I really want to try his liquid lipsticks. What he's known for. He has a mini set of nude lipsticks that look crazy beautiful. And I really want to try them because... They just look so amazing and nude for every day. Love that. He's definitely on my list of products to try. The lucky last but not least because this is something I really, really, really want to try this year is KL Polish. I don't know if you've heard of that, but Kathleen Lights on YouTube, you'll know of her if you're watching me for sure. She has started a nail polish company. I love her nail polishes. She comes out with some really unique colors. I also really love the photo shoots that Kathleen Lights does for her collection launches. She's such a beautiful person like inside and out she's just stunning go to kl polish instagram and look through her launch photos she gets dressed up she looks mad good and crazy it's just beautiful i love it i think it's an awesome way to introduce the colors and i love that she has a meaning and theme behind every nail polish that she comes out with so i definitely want to try those and that's it i think that was a pretty good mix it's mostly eyeshadow sorry let me know what your nine brands you want to try in 2019 would be i'll have a look at them and see if i like them too thank you so much for tuning into this video and i hope that you stay for the next ones if you do want to make sure you hit that subscribe button i'll have this eye tutorial up on my channel soon super fun festival slash just plain old colourful because I love colourful makeup. You'll see me in the next video but I won't see you so make sure you comment so I can talk to you. Alrighty, I'll catch you on another day or another night. Alrighty, I'm done. I'm actually done finito for the day. Good.